Hi friends, I'm Raina and welcome to this full body mobility class. For this class, it may be helpful to have a blanket for your knees, some blocks if you'd like, but the props and support is really up to you. So take a moment, know yourself, and let's get started in tabletop. <sighs> Hands are about shoulder distance apart. Knees are about hips distance. With an inhale, find cow pose, but really try to articulate through the spine. Exhale, curl the tailbone under, let that travel up the back, press the earth away for cat. Good, inhale, flare the tailbone, let that travel up the spine, pull the shoulder blades together, cow pose. Exhale, curl your tailbone under, round up the spine, pull the shoulder blades away from each other for cat. Good, three more, inhale, cow. Exhale, cat. Last one. Good. Come back to neutral. Walk your hands slightly to the right side of your mat. Left foot comes out and around outside of your left hand. Maybe you use blocks here. Maybe you press onto the fingertips. Let your hips move forward. Knee moves towards your toes. Take an inhale, lift your heart. Exhale, hips back, half splits, four more. Inhale forward. Exhale, hips back for two, three. <laughs> for two. Last one. Good, come back. Press your right fingertips or hand down into the earth or your blocks. Peel your left arm towards the sky. Squeeze your legs towards each other. Breathing right here for three, two, and one. Left hand comes down. Slide your left foot back under your body and then move on to the right or move your hands to the left and bring your right foot up, pardon my word jumble. Walk your hands and your blocks forward, hips move towards the top of the mat. Right knee moves towards your right toes, lift your heart up, take an inhale. Exhale, hips back, right leg moves a little straighter. Good, inhale forward, exhale back. Three more. Two. And one. Good, come back into your lunge, press your left hand down, right arm opens towards the sky. Really squeeze the legs towards each other and twist just from the spine for three. Two. And one. Right hand comes down. Slide your right knee back under your body. Sit your hips back towards your heels for a moment. Maybe your hands need to stay on the ground to make this possible. Maybe it's available to lean back. Three rounds of breath right here. Good, coming up, lift your hips up, but stay on your knees. I'm just gonna turn to angle myself lightly towards you. With your next inhale, bring your arms overhead. Exhale, cactus your arms wide, pull your shoulder blades together. Good, keep hugging your inner arms in towards your rib cage. Flip your palms towards the sky, bring your hands in. Good, open them out, press them up and overhead. Good, open them out, cactus them wide, draw them in. Bring the hands to touch, good, last one. Beautiful, release your hands down, give your wrists a couple little twirls, a couple little whirls. And from here, sit back, hips come to either side, coming onto your bottom, feet come wide. Hands press behind you, toes pull towards your body. Keep your chest center, start to drop your legs right. Center, drop them left. Center, right, center, left, good. Center, right, center, and left, good. This time center, drop them right, swing that left arm around. Finding 90-90 shape or a deer pose. Maybe you lean a little to the right to make this possible. Start to pulse your chest forward for five, four, three, two, one. 
three, two, and one. Good, come back to center. Maybe this back leg needs to flip in to make extending the front leg possible. You'll know pretty quick if your back hip is like, no way. Then you just flip it in, left foot comes to the inner thigh, pulse your collarbones towards your right toes for five, four, three, two, and one. Come back up, left arm comes behind you. Maybe use your hands to help, or maybe you pull that right foot in, move through center, and drop to the left for that same shape on the other side. Start to pulse your collarbones forward for five, four, three, two, and one. Come back up, lean back, extend that left leg. Maybe flip your right foot in, pulse the collarbones for five, four, three, two, and one. Coming up. Bring your left foot in, maybe use your hands to help, maybe not as you come to center, and extend your legs out. <sighs> Pull your toes towards your shins. Take a moment, lift your heart up. <sighs> Start to fall forward, keeping your hands on your legs. Feel that space where you feel like you can still get up without pressing into the ground. Pause there, and then pull yourself up. This may be easier to kind of assess if you bring your hands in front of your body, fold forward, find that spot where you're like, okay, I can still power myself up and come on up. One more. And up. Good. Cross the ankles. Rock a little side to side. Good. Pull your shoulders up towards your ears and shrug them down. One more, shoulders come up and down. Good, drop your chin towards your chest. Scrape your chin across your right collarbone towards your right shoulder. Draw a little rainbow as you come over to the left shoulder and scrape across the left back to center. Pause, other direction, scrape to the left. Draw that little rainbow, come to the right. Scrape to the right, pause at the center. Good. Lift your head up. With an inhale, bring your arms overhead. Interlace your fingers, and as you exhale, bring your hands to the base of your skull. Thumbs travel down your neck. Side bend to the right. Side bend left. Right and left just a few times. Good, come back to center. Take a few little twists. Good, come back to center. Press your palms towards the sky as you extend your arms straight. Take an inhale. Exhale, bend the elbows. Two more, inhale, reach. Exhale, bend. Inhale, reach. Exhale, bend. Release your hands down to your thighs. Soften into your seat. Take a moment. Thank yourself for making time for your practice. A moment to thank your body for being wonderful. And thank you all so much for joining me today. Have a beautiful rest of your day or night. And I'll see you next time we're together.